Hey guys, so today I'm going to go over um, how to migrate a site from from staging to production on WP Engine. Okay, so I have made this is my staging site right here, and the only the only difference between staging and live is GDPR is a GDPR is the so okay let's jump in here make sure you're on the right you're on your account which I am Shane web guy go to sites brings us here and then so what I want to what I want to do which I've already done is create a backup point And you can see the backup point is created here, but let's, uh, let's we'll call this number two, which is some descriptive name. Create staging backup. And depending on how long the, how big the site is, is how long it'll take, but it's usually pretty fast. And then once, once we're done here, then we get a courtesy email from WP Engine number two. So that's done. Now I'm not going to back up production because I've just backed it up, but probably want to do the same thing, you know, create another backup point. But I guess just to track time, we'll uh, back video test, create production backup. Okay, and you can see that backup for video test. This is this is complete. Okay, now let's proceed to the migration. From production, copy from, so I'm not using um, development right now, I'm using staging. Okay, and you can see you'll, once this loads, you'll see all my backup points. Okay, from staging to production, preview copy, copy environment. Copy started, warning this can take a while, you will be notified. Catching web guy when this has been complete. So let's give it a, a couple minutes. Okay, so that really took uh, you know somewhere around somewhere around one minute. So now let's look at the original. I I open this up in a new tab. But the original is GDRP is the. If we refresh this now, oops. It is now A. So let's browse around the site, make sure there's no. No other issues. Back to the blog. Okay, and it's still okay. So that's how you uh, migrate a site from uh, production to live. Thank you.